we started doing big bookish events two years ago with uh, the first dinner in the Great Hall at Hogwarts, uh, and it was a Harry Potter holiday feast. This time it is an evening at Hogwarts, so it's really an all-encompassing event. Students are going to get the opportunity to be sorted into houses, win house points by going to different classes, including potions, history of magic, um, and divination. Uh, so they'll be reading tea leaves and uh, competing in Harry Potter trivia. There will also be a costume contest uh, and the ability to win the house cup where they'll get t-shirts. This is our second time doing it. So the first time everyone was sorted into a house so they didn't know where they were going to be and so now everyone who's returning they already know what house they're in so we get to kind of celebrate all the newcomers who are coming in and we're going to be like a new house like it is at the beginning of every Harry Potter book so we're excited. Yeah, so about two days after the first Harry Potter event, um, everyone, Addy included, started asking when's the next Harry Potter <laughs> event. Um, so we decided to bring it back after uh, two years, so last year was Gatsby. Um, and a lot of the things are the same. We were able to reuse some things, but we have some special surprises this time, um, including the floating candles are going to light up, which was a massive student request. So there will be everything from butter beer uh, to pumpkin pasties, um, little hand pies with pumpkin in them. Uh, there will also be uh, some chocolate frogs as part of the celebration at the mm -hmm. end. Around 150 people are going to be there that night, so it's going to be a lot of fun.